Find the number of neutrons, the number of neutrons in 7 milligrams of carbon-14 isotope. Now carbon-14 isotope, we know it, its atomic number is 6, but the atomic, you know, the mass number over here is 14. So if you want to know the number of neutrons, the number of neutrons here, the number of neutrons over here is equal to that will be the this uh, mass number which is 14 minus the atomic number which is 6 so we have 8 8 neutrons are present in one atom of carbon here right one carbon 14 isotope contains 8 neutrons so uh, let's first find uh, the molar mass we know the one mole of carbon one mole of carbon uh, is actually 14 grams right so 14 grams of carbon 14 14 grams of carbon 14 is actually one mole right contains one mole of carbon atoms and one mole of carbon means how many moles of neutrons eight neutrons because one atom contains eight neutrons so therefore the one mole of carbon contains eight moles of neutrons so we can say we got eight moles of neutrons we got eight moles of neutrons in one mole of carbon which is actually the 14 grams so therefore one gram one gram of carbon 14 one gram of carbon 14 contains how many moles of uh, neutrons that will be 8 upon 14 8 by 14 moles right moles of neutrons now our question over here is 7 milligrams so 7 milligrams in terms of grams is how much? That is 7 into 10 to the power minus 3 milligrams, you know, grams, right? So therefore, 1 gram contains this much, this number of moles. So therefore, 7 moles, you know, 7 uh, milligrams, right? 7 milligrams contains how much? So 7 into 10 to the power minus 3 grams of carbon-14, of carbon-14 contains how many moles of neutrons? It will be 8 by 14, which is 1 gram, into the, the given sample, which is 7 into 10 to the power negative 3. Now, this is the number of moles of neutrons. Number of moles of neutrons present in, you know, the 7 milligrams of carbon-14. So, therefore, the number if you want to know the what is the actual number the total number of atoms the total number of neutrons the total number of neutrons you know we got the number of moles here now we want to convert it into the total number of neutrons right total number of neutrons we got the moles of neutrons and this is the number of moles of neutron you know this much this is the number of moles of neutrons and we have to find the total number of neutrons now. We have to convert the moles into the, the number. So we can say the total number of neutrons will be this number of moles, which is 8 by 14 into 7 into 10 to the power negative 3 times the Avogadro number, right? The Avogadro number is 6.022 into 10 power 23, right? This is the, the number of the moles of this will be the total number of the neutrons. So when you simplify this one, you get 2.408 into the 10 to the power 21, the neutrons. This is the number of neutrons, right? This is the number of neutrons present in seven milligrams of the carbon-14 acetone.